Hey guys, today I will be reviewing for you the Noodler's Nip Creeper Flex Fountain Pen. The pen comes in this cardboard box which is very neatly designed. I like these images a lot and I think it gives the box a nice character. This particular pen is in the Navajo finish, it is made out of resin and it's a piston filler. Basically it is a converter already built into the pen. It has a screw cap and it pushes the post. The cap has this clip which has a noodler's ink engraving and it is quite springy. It's not very sturdy so I wouldn't clip this pen to a jeans pocket for example. The pen has a steel flex nib and it also has the Noodler's Ink Co. engraving. These nibs don't have a specific size since they are flex nibs but without flexing it is between a fine and a medium. The feed is made out of ebonite and the body of the pen has an ink window. Let's see how this writes. I have mine inked up with JR Ben 1670 Emerald of Shivor which is an absolutely gorgeous ink and we are on a rodeo dot pad. I like to write with this unposted but even if you like to post your pens it has a very nice balance weighing in at just 10 grams. The grip is quite narrow so if you have bigger hands you might not like this pen. Comparing it to the Noodlers Ahab which is a bigger flex pen from Noodlers I like this a whole lot more probably because I have quite small hands. The number one tip I can share with you is that if you're writing with a flex pen, you absolutely need to take your time and you might even need to practice. As you can see, on some of the letters I got railroading because I was writing a bit too fast. As you can see this is an amazing ink with these gold specks in it, it almost looks like there's glitter in the ink. I hope all the Harry Potter fans recognize that quote I just did for the sample. As a flying variation, the difference is pretty massive and it's very wet. As of reverse writing, definitely doable and it's quite fine, but quite scratchy as well. As I've said, this is a wet pen.
and even on road your paper it bled quite badly so i hope you enjoyed today's video all of my links will be down below and i will see you soon in my next video bye